So welcome from Focus Gaming News here at the media booth at Sigma 2023 to David Harris, who I'm delighted to have here with me. You are the program tech team leader of Refer On, which is a cutting edge solution optimizing affiliate market pro marketing programs. That's correct. I looked that up on the internet. Yeah. <laughs> so what I need you to do now is just fill in the gaps so, for me, uh, David. Essentially, Referon uh, came out with this idea that the affiliate platforms and what affiliate users, both managers and operators, just needed a bit more up to date. So we decided to look what was out in the market and built this product. Um, and already we're seeing kind of raving reviews from both affiliates and managers. And we're here at Sigma just to kind of get out there, get more discovery and get more clients on board. So we're here. Well, welcome. And I'm going to not let you get away with that. I'm going to go under okay. the skin again and Good. I'm going to say to you, OK, so that's what you do. But who are your clients? Who are you talking to and sure. why do they need you? So we have three major clients. Um, our major focus is operators such as affiliate programs. Uh, we just migrated a few of the other big ones. Maybe you've heard of Seven Stars Partners. Uh, 247 partners, and we've got some great migrations coming up from Partnerzillas and Excitewinds coming up as well. So that's great. That is the operators, that's our main clients. Now, without operators, you cannot have affiliates. I mean, this whole Sigma event is for affiliates. So we still try to cater towards a lot of their needs. Uh, before we released the product, we did a lot of affiliate workshops. We looked at what was working, what wasn't working, and we tried to do a lot of, I like to call quality of life changes on the product, but also kind of revisits of what makes a platform like that. So a lot of the wins you see for the app and user, the affiliate also has those wins. So those are our two major ones. Okay. We're also looking at providers because you need to get your foot in the door on providers. Uh, so data providers, your PAMs, your platforms to then let us integrate. Because the more we can have on board of those, the more clients and operators we can bring on board. So okay. it's kind of the three major profiles we have there. So that's the three major profiles. So let me ask you, what are the markets that you're in? Or are you everywhere? So for now, we're really focused on iGaming uh, as our major vertical and obviously the affiliation on there. It's just the way the product is designed. We are very much for those. Um, we did look at how maybe retail and stuff, but it doesn't quite fit how the product is right now. So our main vertical, there's a lot still to go through. So we have no running out of clients anytime soon. So that's our, that's our main focus. Brilliant. And you are then, there's territories wise, you're looking yeah, at all it's over not the quite place. Works. So, so this works as a data processor. So okay. data can come in from operators with various licenses, whether it be the SGA, MGA, whatever it is, Curacao. But then we would take the anonymized player data and run it through. So as long as they're licensed to do that, we can process the anonymized stuff. So I always come to them saying, you have the license, right? Then we're good. So that, that's fine. <laughs> I like that. This is your first question. That's fine. I'll take you as long as you've got a license that's to your it. mind. That's I love it. that. Well, thank you for kind of clarifying that and putting that all yeah. in context. Now I'm fully understanding what you're doing. So I'm going to ask you, you mentioned just a second ago about why you were here at Sigma. Uh -huh. You mentioned affiliates. You mentioned this. But really, I mean, this is one of these big key events. And this event always falls at the end of the year, yep. which means it's also a great time to review what's happened in the past year, 2023, what's been going on. So tell me, I mean, how has the so, year been for you? Referon launched this year. Yeah. So we launched at uh, ICE IGB in February. Yeah. Since then, we've got 10 clients under 10 months. So we're going to keep going with this growth. We take these big conferences kind of up in arms. We do loads of discovery uh, meetings, and we really try to reach out there and really meet on board. Maybe not everyone has knows about us yet, but we're doing, but anyone who's checked out my LinkedIn, I'm all over the place. Um, we're really trying to get the word out um, and for people to come and check us out and maybe for people to check their affiliate platform needs. And I think that's why I wanted to take the opportunity to ask you just to clarify and yep. explain what you do because you're, you're, you're relatively new to market. Yeah. So then my next question on top of all of that is what makes you stand out? So, what makes you different from everybody else who's here? We've got 500 or so exhibitors here. 500 exhibitors, but not all of those, thankfully, are our direct competition. Of course. Thankfully. <laughs> now, that would be a very crowded marketplace. Now, as I kind of alluded to earlier, we kind of looked at what other programs and features we looked at and we have experience in others and we see 
from our own experience in the affiliate market and what the platforms are, we improve them. So we have three major USPs. We have a company grouping functionality, which allows both the admin users and the affiliates to kind of group everything up at the company level, making it super easy for reporting and reviewing needs. And the affiliates have one login for their API needs. We have fantastic reporting capabilities of any structure, any measure, any group, or any API. And lastly, our rewarding capabilities are super fluid to making it super, uh, much, much easier to make your business decisions um, much, much quicker, basically. So you're talking about the rewarding. Your last point yeah. was, again, was your rewarding. Yeah, rewarding, reporting, and the company grouping will be our major USBs. Look at you. This is smooth. I like in this. Now, of course, you're new to market. You've got a lot of stuff going on. It's, it's a, a new entity, and you've got a lot of people that you wanted to talk to, and congratulations on those 10 big clients that obviously you are having a great client relationship with. But problems happen. Things go wrong. And I know, because I've done a little bit of digging and, and, and stalking of you, that one of the things you pride yourself on is how you resolve challenges. And I think that's it's what I keep hearing today. I've heard it all day. There seems to be a change in the market where the people sitting in front of me keep saying it's all about the client. It's about making sure we're looking after them and making sure that we resolve any issues, hopefully before they happen. But if not, we, we have a quick response time. I'm assuming that is crucial to what you're doing. It's not crucial just to me. It's crucial. It should be for any software out there. Any software has its users and they're going to have problems at some point. What we tried to do is we built uh, this full support documentation. I've done videos. I've done how-to guides. I mentioned earlier, even before we were live, I was doing affiliate workshops to say, what do you need in the system? And we'll get that in. I'm going to be honest, our first couple of weeks were a bit rocky. I mean, it's launch time. You're going to expect some rockiness. But with the help of the development team behind, we managed to resolve kind of some of the reporting functionalities within one to two weeks. That was done. And now I do check-ins on the earlier clients, like a six months in, to say, how are we doing? We're getting some great feedback from affiliates. And we're releasing features every two to three weeks on either fixes, new features. And we have some fantastic features coming through into Q1 and even into Q2, which has already been penciled in. Which leads me very nicely on to the big question. Yep. You launched this year. What is in store for next year? You, 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 you've intimated a whole bunch uh, of things. Yeah. Uh, so I, without giving too much away, we have some great... No, 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 go on, go on. <laughs> <laughs> we have some fantastic features involving in the, the payments module. We've just launched some fully, fully mobile responsiveness for, mobile, uh, for affiliates and admin users. We've got postbacks and pixels coming in within the next two to three weeks. Um, we have loads of kind of reporting functionalities of click details, IP details. We have, um, for those who may be familiar with it, there's the ASR feature, which is the affiliate standard reporting. We're getting that in after some requests for that. So we have some stuff coming. Uh, I don't want to give too much away, but I think that's enough for, for, for now. Look. David, the other thing I really loved from talking to you is you said we have 10 clients, one a month. More or less. We More had less. some bulks of stuff. But Absolutely. Yeah. But I love that idea of, of managed growth for the business. Because, of course, you just referred to the fact that you're looking after your, your early clients and making sure that they're okay and everything. If you could sum up, for you, for David, and, and also for Referon, what is the the theme, what is the main idea behind what you do, if you could put it into a nutshell, into one sentence, so that anyone that's watching that says, yes, I want to be one of those clients. Next month, I want to be that client. Referon offers a state-of-the-art platform that gives you statistics so easily that it was a complete kind of misnomer of why it wasn't there in the first place. So we tried to look at all of these functions a bit of a zeitgeist movement, but that's what we want to do, and that's what we want to give you, data transparency in a data-driven world. There you go. There I like go. it. David, thank you so that's much okay. for sitting with me. Thank you for your time today. <laughs>